back to another episode of my channel so today's video is it a natural hair video i'd like to do bantu knot outs on my hair and i feel like right now my hair has um changed a little bit of length it's still short but you know i have a little bit of length so i'd really love to try out this hairstyle on my hair yeah and my hair is clean i shampooed it yesterday i deconditioned it so we are starting off on clean hair the two products that i'll be using today is the vertical lock and twist gel and i'll also be using this hair oil shea butter and soybean oil from vertica and this video is not sponsored yeah i just love the products and yeah so if you're interested then definitely keep on watching so i'll start off by spraying water on my hair like so it's dry right now yeah because i washed it yesterday i slept on it It's actually my first time doing Bantu knot outs on short hair, so I'm really curious to know how it will turn out. So I'll start off with this oil from Vatica. And then the lock and twist gel. So I'm going to start off with the bantu knots. So I'll just do the same thing all over my head like so. So I'm done installing my bantu knots. I'll have them in for around 24 hours. I'll come back tomorrow morning and take them down and then see the end result. So yeah. Hi guys, so it's the next day, 24 hours since I installed my bantu knots. So I want to take them down. I did my makeup just so that my hair and my face can, you know, zinezambatana. So yeah, let's take them down and see the end results. So I've decided to use this hair oil, the shea butter and soybean oil from Vatica. So this is the same oil I used yesterday to install my bantu knots. So this is just going to help me while, you know, to make the process much easier and smoother because I feel like they are quite tight. Yeah. So. So. Rub it into my hands and then, yeah. 
and I feel like they are so I feel like they are really defined which I really love this is some, what I was hoping for so separation time <laughs> 